The next unit that I want to talk about is the flashcards unit. Now, this is a little buggy in some ways because the first time you click it, it may not work. So all I'm going to do to start with on flashcards is I'm going to click it, I'm going to go back, and I'm going to click it again. And then it will work just fine, I should do. Now, this is a little bit more tricky. You've got your instructions down here, and you've got your points as normal, OK? And up here, you have three different buttons, objective only, topic only, and all available. Objective only will only give you flashcards for this particular unit. So in this case, distance, speed, velocity, and displacement. If, however, you click the topic only button, this will give you all the flashcards available for the entirety of this unit. So at the moment, it should just be flashcards for vectors and scalars and distance, speed, velocity, and displacement. But by the time you get to the end, that means you'll get flashcards for all of the things you've completed throughout this unit. OK? So for now, I just want speed, distance, time. So describe the difference between speed and velocity is my first question. So I'm going to think to myself, I'm going to um, say, I think the difference between speed and velocity is that speed is a scalar and vector is a vector. So I'll click this, and then it gives me the answer. Speed is scalar, which means it's a magnitude. Velocity is a direction. Good. I, I got that right, although I didn't say enough detail. So I'm going to give myself a tick for that. And you'll notice now my correct answers goes up to 1. Uh, between, the, between the beginning and end of a normal day, which of distance or displacement are you sure to have a good idea of? Um, I'm going to say displacement. I don't really understand. Oh, I got it right. But I didn't understand it, really. I just had a guess. So I'm going to click X. And I've learned a bit from the explanation, but I'm going to click X. And that gives me an incorrect answer. Now, this is really important. And it's really important that you tick correct or incorrect, um, whether you were or weren't. Because the correct answers now won't show up for, again for a little time. That question won't come up again. But your incorrect answer, that will probably show up again the next day that you do this. So this spaces out to help you memorize them as best as possible. So it's really important that you are truthful in whether you got it right or wrong. So this is flashcards. And I just want to remind you that when you first load it, click it, go back, click it again, and it should work just fine.